Hello everyone, welcome once again to Geospatial Tutorial. I keep receiving mail from people stating that they do not have attribute table in their image. Yes, it does happen if your uh, data in the image is continuous. For example, let's consider uh, this digital elevation model and uh, try to open the attribute table and it is disabled and it says below that disabled if this raster does not have an attribute table because it represents continuous data like aerial imagery rather than the discrete or thematic data such as land use classification. So primary idea is that your image is not having an attribute table. Let's zoom it to the pixel level. I'm sure you're able to see the pixels here and let's see if these pixels have any data. Yes, this pixel has some data that uh, one is stretched value and the pixel value. Let's not discuss about stretched value beyond the scope of this particular tutorial. Pixel value represents the elevation of that particular uh, pixel above mean C11. So we can definitely conclude that the data is existing, only the attribute table is not existing, which basically means to say that you can definitely build a, an attribute table for this particular image. Let's see how do we do it. There are certain conditions where it says that you should have only one band if you are trying to build an attribute table, primarily because in FCC image, that is a false color composite image or a multispectral image, will have uh, many pixels in a particular uh, location. So each pixel will have a different value and each pixel uh, is overlaid on the other. So extraction of a single value from many pixels is not practical and also it will not give the required result. So if at all you want to extract the attribute table from or build an attribute table to a false color composite or a multispectral image, just extract the band to which you want to build a attribute table and do the process as shown in the next steps. Let's go to Arc Toolbox and open Data Management Tools and here you have an option called Raster. Double click on that and go to the tool set called Raster Properties. Here you have an option called build raster attribute table. Double click on that and select the band, the band, not the image. If you have many bands in that image, select the band for which you want to build an attribute table. Select the band and click OK. Your process has just commenced and the attribute table will be built for this image. The process is complete. Let's go to table of content and try to see whether this image has an attribute table. Now, yes, the attribute table uh, is enabled now. We'll just click on that and here we go. These are the values what we were basically looking for. These are the elevations of pixels. That's how do we add uh, an attribute table to the image. Keep watching.